sitting here listening to my music list and I'm starting to find a little clarity. I'm starting to understand why this thing is so hard. This game of entrepreneurship, shit, this game of life. It's because the real answer is really found when you're pulling from opposite directions. I'm sitting here late and saying, why, why, why am I so blessed? Why is all this good stuff happening? And it's because I'm a contradiction. Because I'm, I'm, I've got this funny juxtaposition where I'm pulling from opposite directions. I don't give a fuck what any of you think about me. Yet I'll read every comment and I'll listen to everything all of you say about me. Because I listen. I talk a fuckload. I'm always talking. I'm cutting people off. I'm talking. But I'm listening. I'm listening 24-7. I'm always patient. I'm playing the long game. But I'm always quitting things. Every day. Trying. Testing not crippled by stop and starting. How do I figure that out? How do I understand when it's time to give up on something or when it's time to persevere? How do I understand and how do I feel and how do I decide when to listen to somebody's feedback or to know when they're trolling or don't give a fuck or only seeing service level? How, how is this happening? How am I working 24-7, 365, yet it doesn't feel like I'm working? How am I always constantly putting out content and building my brand yet never thinking about it and just living my life how am i documenting instead of creating where is this where is this zen coming from where is this call to action coming from why is this plan working so well and how how do i get all you youngsters <laughs> and when i say youngsters i mean the 59 year old who hasn't grown up yet who hasn't been willing to look at the world and it comes from this comes from the most macro. It's clear enough for me, I'm starting to see it. It's understanding that nobody gives a fuck and that that's okay and that's the way it should be. I live on empathy. You shouldn't give a fuck. You've got you to worry about. I'm empathetic to that. That's the game. And we're all dealt with different cards. We've all got strengths and weaknesses. We've got the advantages and the disadvantages. Plenty see white privilege, so do I. I see privilege in being from the streets and having zero and being hungrier. There's so many different ways. And of course, some are better than others at the most macro, but I don't even spend the time to figure that out. Because by the time you figure out if it was fair, you're fucking finished. And so instead of doing that, I do, and I do, and I do. And I'm always planning and I'm not planning. And I've always got a game plan and a strategy, and I've always not got one. I'm just going off the hip from intuition, from learned behavior, from pattern recognition, because I've been doing this from the get. When I was 12, 13, 14, 15, I knew. I did. It's why I got those shit grades. Shout out to everybody who saw that report card on Instagram. You know, it's what I do. And so as I sit here and lay and look and think and debate and look out at the auction and listen to this music, it's becoming clearer. 2017 is gonna be a great year. Not just for me, but for you. Because as I find clarity, I'm gonna suffocate negativity. I'm gonna suffocate excuses. If you're gonna be in my community, you're gonna give up and leave if you wanna believe in those things because I'm gonna pound it, push it, press it harder than I ever had before. Because the truth is, I'm thankful, I'm grateful. I'm working on myself 24-7, my goals, my ambitions, and I'm working on your goals and your ambitions 24-7. That's pulling from opposite directions. That's what I do. That's what I do harder, stronger, better than anybody. Honey Empire, bitches. Build the biggest building of all time. The biggest, best business of all time. Like a fucking tortoise. Like a slow fucking tortoise. Chip away every day. Underestimated all along the way. Got my fans who are delusional. I got the rest of the majority of the market that doesn't think I can get it. That doesn't see the behavior. Because they're thinking 2017. They're thinking 2019. They're thinking 2021. I'm thinking life, bitches. I'm thinking motherfucking life. And so I promise you, community, the people that are listening to this right now, you've given me the greatest fucking gift of all. You keep your $500 master classes. You keep your $5,000 masterminds. You keep your $97 eBooks. You keep that in your pocket and you do you. You're gifting me with the greatest fucking thing on earth. Your attention and your word of mouth. Every fucking time you tag somebody in my comments on Instagram, every time you share my story on Snapchat, every time you post and share on Facebook, means the world to me. Every retweet means the world to me. That means you're putting me on. You're co-signing this fucking journey. And for that, I will never take it for granted. I love you. Happy 2017.